Conventional wisdom says to try and create some separation from your opponent. Well, that's tough to do considering some superstars foam at the mouth like sadistic animals in this type of setting. It is difficult to get a reprieve from an onslaught when it is foam. Hoping to end it early. His shoulder up after the two count. It was an even count. Great job by the ref. You can't accuse our guest referee of going into business for himself after that fair count. Ah, uh, setting them up for, for a fisherman buster. Referee in position. There's two. No kicks out in time. And the referee is not playing favorites here. Our official kept a fair count there, really earning his stripes. Getting him into the corner. Oh, the knees. And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in an ODQ match. Oh, come on, Cole. It's not about being sadistic. It's about being smart. There's no safety net and no disqualification. He goes for the cover. He gets his shoulder up before three. And our referee watched that one closely. A licensed official's count has to keep a steady pace, and that's what he did. Ooh, that's going to leave a mark. I see how it is. Going to take any shortcut to bypass a clean competition. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a shortcut, Saxton. Shoot! Slam! He's going for it all. We're gonna finish it off. Swanton bomb. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. He's been quickly taking control here. He's being consistent and businesslike. Oh, target acquired and destroyed. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Going for a power slam, slips down. Counter into an inverted DDT. Showing him what a real alpha male looks like. Oh, I missed you. I wanted a knee. Shoulders down. This could be it. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? And that was a slow count, and we all know it. Who knows what was going on there, but it sure wasn't fair officiating. Moonsault! Moonsault! He just isn't being given any room to recuperate. In this situation, he has to get resourceful. And come on, no! Don't bring the trash can out. That's for cleaning. Well, Saxton, it's about to be used to clean house. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. He skirts around it. Oh, and a double foot stomp. Oh, my. Devastating impact to the back. Locking the wrist. Kamagoye on the mark. Oh. Powerbomb position. Fighting out. Hammering away with punches to the face. Looking for something, anything under the ring. He's got the table, and I can only imagine what he's thinking of doing with it. He's back into the ring. Oh, boy, sticking with the classics. A barbed wire bat. Oh, cracked across the skull with that barbed wire bat. Can he do it here? Big kick out. Looks like our guest official is pretty good at this ref thing. Our special referee doing the zebra stripes proud.
Ducks under. Oh, there's the Pele kick. That was not a standard count, and we all know it. Frankly, the officials... And now targeting the official. Bang! Pummeled by the double stomp. This is ridiculous. The referee was calling this thing completely down the middle, and now look at this. Oh, we weren't in there, Cole. Maybe there was something we couldn't see on our monitors. Into the cover! Kicks out. And that is how the count should be. This ref is taking the job seriously. Our guest referee is showing superb reaction skills, not missing a thing. <laughs> Evading offense. Uh-oh, double underhook. This is going to be nasty. Butterfly pile driver. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. And the ref is refusing to get a view of the submission attempt. Give up now. No, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. Oh, God. Piercing shot with the barbed wire. He thinks he has it. Almost ended it there. And our guest official calling that one down the middle. You can't say our ref messed around with his cadence during that pin. Oh, launching himself in the ropes. Our referee got that down. That's the count cadence of a fair official. And pay attention to the referee's excellent positioning. Footage from this should be used at the Performance Center. And appreciate him while you can, folks. He's not getting paid by the hour. He saw it coming. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Stop! Shoulder up. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. And this one might be headed ringside. Who even thought to put a light tube under the ring? This isn't some backyard operation. Setting foot in the ring now. Oh, shattering impact from the light tube. Places their opponent all the way on the top rope. You gotta wonder what's going through their mind. Uh, their opponent trying to, to thwart their plans, but the superstar planning their attack now. Oh, this is this is getting dangerous. Look at the shots to the back of the neck. What in the world are they planning here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Avalanche points and Rana. Trouble is on the horizon. The official asking him, is he going to tap? Is he going to tap? And he lets him out of the submission hold. Could have been a strategic move to wear down that body part for something bigger later. Uh-oh. Now's the time to capitalize. Two. Not a win. Wow, he's going to celebrate all. There you have it, the one standing tall at the end of this hotly contested match. You have to hand it to them. They found an opening, even when it looked like things could easily turn in their competitors' favor here.